Come on, you apes. Do you want to live forever? Hi, I'm Baron. I grew up loving Starship Troopers movies. Well, the first one, the rest sucked. And I'm playing this free demo on Steam. Last video, we beat this mission. This video, we're gonna beat this one. Let's see what they gotta say in the Federal Network, though, because I, I love those little intro cinematics. Problem, this is like clear, watching the movies. Is and then having me the talk over it. It's fantastic. Into gear to protect it's the mines? And, and they call people. them mines? Gimli, what do you have to say about that? So it's us versus an army of endless bugs. Now, we're gonna go exploring the town here. Survivors, take down those bugs. But the problem is, sometimes my soldiers are kind of like derpy derp. Can we kill them before they eat the people? No. Sorry guys, I'm the Marine Corps. I'm supposed to be helping you, but we, we didn't do too great of a job, did we? All right, let's position ourselves up on the high ground and shoot down on the arachnids. Yeah, but you guys remember Starship Troopers? Have any of you watched it? I found out much to my chagrin that like it came out in 1997. We should be able to cut now, the cool thing about this radio station that we're going to get is we can call in reinforcements, right? So what we want to do is situate our boys okay. up on these Always hills because guess what? Position. Bugs are going to be coming. And if you look on the minimap, these little red hexagons, ooh, Settlers of Catan, Civilization. I love hexagon. They're going to be pouring out bugs, all right? And the hexagon, as we just clearly pointed out, is the superior geometric shape. I think we can all agree on that. Some people claim, you know, triangles because they like the Triforce from Zelda, but they're just wrong, okay? It ain't it. It ain't it, Chief. We're gonna cover this ramp right here. And these poor idiots down there are kind of like, you know, the anvil. And the hammer's gonna be our assault rifle rounds. Position on the high ground over to fire on allied units. But yeah, this is a free-to-play demo on Steam. I'm, I'm pretty excited about the game. Uh, I'd say for the most part, it's definitely making me pretty happy. Bug hive activity has been detected we over here. Them. But oh, keep coming until we let's go get them. Now, one of the things I can do while I'm here next to the radio station is if any of my guys are injured, this guy's actually kind of injured. So we can call in reinforcements via dropships. Now, they do arrive really quickly. I feel like in real life they wouldn't. But then again, in real life, we don't fly to other planets and fight giant bugs. Attack move, boys. So they're going to be trickling in unless, of course, you know, we get over here and throw some big boom skis down that hole. I'm trying to think of like all of the really, really good movies with like space marines and that kind of stuff in them. Ooh, okay. We're doing okay. Oh, you know what we're gonna need to do is freaking throw a grenade. Frag out, boys. I mean, we could have done it earlier. I, I agree. I concur, I can concur with your assessment. I also can't really say the word concur, but you know what? It's fine. We're doing pretty good, though. Nobody's dead yet, right? Do we see any dead Marines? Oh, there was one there. Maybe one or two. All right. This is going to need to be settled with grenades. We're going to drop it right here. These guys are not firing. They, ooh, that grenade stopped them, though. All right. If we time this again, we might not even need it, honestly. That was a waste of a grenade. We'll frag out early. You want to frag out early and often, don't you? And let's go. Yeah, so basically you can kind of see uh, how frequently they're going to be putting in new bugs. Oh, we're on a re-timer. A re-timer. That doesn't even... That's not even English. Jeez, look at this. Okay, that grenade was very much needed. And then essentially once we stop them... Okay. We're gonna send a unit into the bug hole. Bug hole, bug hive, they're synonymous. So they go in, they're like, oh man, I'm scared of the dark. They come out, throw a grenade, and boom. One down, how many more to go? Oh, sweet. I feel like we're gonna be able to build a base here. Capture the radio stations. Got it. We could probably run down back here if we felt we needed to replace our losses, but it probably just makes more sense to move north. Dude, look at this. It's funny how like in the grim darkness of the far, far future, we still have four-wheeled vehicles. Like, are they at least electric? Where are the flying cars, man? Definitely remnants of dead bugs, so you know, stuff got real here. All right, we're gonna move him them here to see if they can't fire over that semi-truck. They didn't really. So, oh, okay, just two arachnid warriors over here, two to the north. I can't wait, and I'm actually kind of curious if in the future we're going to be able to call in air support. Because right now, like, having rifle troopers, you're like, okay. I mean, these rifles clearly aren't even that effective. Like, you have to empty, like, full magazines into these guys. All right, boys, capture the radio station. Command has allocated... 
allocated you additional resources to fortify the outpost against a rachnid attack. Oh, this is cool. Bug hive activity detected from both sides. So we're gonna get what? Two sets of engineering squad? Alright, combat engineers. And combat engineers. They're gonna come via the drop ships. And then these guys can build heavy machine gun turrets. And we'll put one over here. That way both sides are protected via heavy machine guns. We'll put these rifle squads kind of scattered around there. And then I feel like we're pretty good because like we're supposed to deploy two of these, right? And then after that, the bugs are coming. Here they come again. Get those MGs fired. Alright. First they're coming from the east. Do you guys ever have to like say, oh man, which way are they coming from? North, south, east, or west? And you're like left, right, or up or down? Or is that just me? I do like this. It, it kind of reminds me of the They Are Billions. You know, the little, this little red triangle, like danger. We got freaking bugs coming, boy. Dang, the heavy MG's just chewing them up. However, I think a decent amount of my rounds are maybe being blocked by this car. This looks like a Tesla truck. <laughs> it's a Tesla truck. Oh, you know what we don't have is like scouts on the high ground here. So it is okay. All right, clear all the bug holes. Should we make a move? I think we should. I'm going to send these three squads over here to try to clear out this one while these guys chill and fight. Do we have to go over this bridge? Oh my God, that's a lot. All right, let's, let's move in. They're going to be pouring up here through this road, right? So if I can start shooting them here, you stay on the high ground. You get on the low ground and lure them out. So Engineers are gonna sit right at this cross point and torch them when they come out, right? Okay, we didn't get near as many as I wanted to. But watch, once they get close, we get the flamethrowers. I don't think we had, did we have flamethrowers in episode one of Starship Troopers? I'm not entirely sure. Yeah, boy. These guys kind of remind me of the pioneers from Company of Heroes. Did you guys, did you guys ever play Company of Heroes? It's a good game. Oh my goodness. Bug layers will spawn bugs until destroyed. I need air support. How do as I do this? I mean, that's that's problematic. Can I throw a grenade over here? Can I throw a grenade? Nope. What if I can I shoot from in between here? Yes. Fantastic. All right, we can hold them here. Excellent, boys. Oh shoot, we have activity from up north. They're all active. This is. Kind of a challenging mission, I think. I mean, look at that. That's two full, like, squads. Yeah, and they don't attack unless I attack them. Okay, we're going north. We're adapting our tactics. Oh, wow, there's like two of them right here. Oh my god, okay. We were gonna need a grenade right now. What is happening? We're jamming up on ourselves. Oh, that guy's about to get eaten, dude. He's the dude in the movie, like, Wah! and he's dead. Can you not flame over a wall, feller? All right, before we do that, he needs to go back and get reinforcements. Wait a minute, what's this? Dropship transport will rapidly drop between two drop... Hold on. We gotta test this out. Oh, they need to be between the bases, I see. So watch. He's gonna <laughs> wait for the guy over here. Right? You waiting for him? And he's gonna pick him up and then drop him down a few feet over. However, now I understand the mechanics. Oh, God. <laughs> I did it, guys. Oh my god, I'm so dumb. Okay, reinforcements. We need two more engineers. The other ones are dead. All right there, feller. You gonna need to fix that. It's slow going through the beggar's canyon here. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't stand in front of each other. You guys know this by now. Our veterancy's doing decently. It's just AR rounds are just not very effective. Oh my god, after holding this, we're gonna have to retreat. But what would the desert fox do? This is when you attack. <gasps> Never mind. Never mind. There's way too many bugs. Okay, that's just nightmare fuel over there. We're gonna take this one out. Maybe this one's easier. All right, you're gonna get reinforcements, and you're gonna get reinforcements. Like, look at that attack move, and they went that way. Don't make no sense, Bobby. All right, frags out, boys. That was a good grenade. That was much better than my previous grenades, which were not very good at all. Oh my god. This is terrifying. Like, normally you want to fight these things in a fortress. Yes. Yes. Good. Okay, let's get up here. Ah, oh, they're just too fast. You idiots. <laughs> you guys are not very good at doing what I tell you to do. I mean, when it comes to roasting bugs, yeah. All right, while the flamethrowers do their thing, we're going to move around and get in that hole. Just a bunch of lonely dudes on a foreign planet trying to get in this bug hole. 
Oh, thank the heavens above. We did it. We did one thing right today. And that's something to be proud of. Yeah. So I kind of have this feeling that these giant red arrows mean there's going to be a massive invasion trickling through this canyon at some point. What? Spitterbugs? What the heck? Where are they? Federal intelligence has detected the presence of spitterbugs. They will likely be encountered in battle soon. Well, how serendipitous. All right, engineers don't like to attack move. Got it. And they're spawning in here. They're spawning from this layer and that layer. There might be even more holes. Yeah, there's another hole right here. All right, we're sending all of them. I mean, you guys want to live forever? Isn't that the line? Yeah, I think that's what we have to do. We're gonna have to hold this hill, hold this bridge while we maybe go around it, or like while we send troops. We have to have a an elevated firing position. I just didn't bring enough troops last time. Yeah, did you see that? Look, I went, I attacked there and they decided to go here. That's a bug. <laughs> and not the kind you can just kill in the game, unfortunately. Redeploy them up at the bridge. What? Oh, shoot. Spitters. Look at these nasty little things. Get those things out of here. Jeez, man, I hate spitters. Okay, how do I disband? Oh, yeah, war support cost. Okay, good. That's what we want. This base, consider it abandoned. Engineers, this is what we're talking about. Okay, heavy machine gun here, and you heavy machine gun there. That is some serious firepower now. Oh, they're still working. Oh, some of the engineers died while getting this working. Oh, it was destroyed. Run, run, run. Don't let the last engineer die. All right, there we go, finally. That should keep everything alive long enough to get going. Yeah, so it's kind of interesting. Not like a classic RTS where you're building bases and doing all that stuff. Like, you're requesting support, men, material, technology, basically, like a uh, better weaponry from orbit, essentially. I'm assuming that's where these dropships is coming from. All right, now that we got them, I'm feeling like we can hold that. You guys need to get down here and torch this thing. Hurry, hurry, hurry. These guys are doing a decent job. Oh, shoot. That's not what I meant to do. We messed up. Oh, God. Oh, God. Run, 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 run. Run down here. Get them in the crossfire. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, that's actually, that actually worked pretty well, I'd say. We gotta remember these bugs is dumb. Ooh, and flamethrowers do a fantastic job. Okay. Use grenades against large hordes. Yep. Oh, that's a lot of spitters. Dang. Thanks. I hate it. Either way, it's just so much to fight. I want to call in air support. That is what I want to do. You think that like when you see a big army of bugs, you just, okay, let's nuke them. But them starship troopers ain't so bright. Could I send a squad to go and get them? <laughs> That's what we're going to try to do. Oh, there they are coming. And these guys should be able to like walk right over this stuff. I mean, look at how big those legs are. All right, let's try to frag grenade some of these guys. Go, go, go! <laughs> there we go, that worked. We lured them into our trap. I love the sound of these heavy machine guns, though. Brrrrat. I mean, they don't do that at all, but it sounds cool. All right, I think spitters might be a little bit weaker. They just keep spawning in. Oh my god. You're gonna need replenishment. Alright, I- I'm at this stalemate right here. I might lose an engineer squad, honestly. I think maybe we need to make use of this spot right here. This is not easy. I was sort of expecting it to be. This is only mission two, mind you. This is literally an endless army of bugs. Here we go. We got the high ground, boys. Jeez. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, it is what it is. All right, maneuver around. All right, we're going in. We're rushing it. We have taken so many casualties right here. Uh, that's one of the things, like when I play an RTS, I try not to like lose too many soldiers, but like, I think what is Sir, clearly evident here. They're asking why the area isn't cleared yet. Why isn't it not clear yet? Oh, that's an easy answer. There's a whole lot of bugs and they're killing my people. All right, let's get them reinforcements. Uh oh, you better pull back or you're dead. All right, there looks like there's a, some new stuff going on here. Are you gonna introduce something new? Spitter bugs, complicate. Oh, snipers! Yes! Heck yes. Okay, this is, this is gonna make me real, real happy. Command center. Requires a command center, got it. 
We will give the command center. Okay, so that's intriguing. Very intriguing. Two sniper teams. Where's my sniper boys at? There's so many landings going on right here. There we go. Okay, they got some reach out and touch someone ability. Supply depot. It's definitely more like tactical than I'd say like maybe strategic. All right, so snipers are doing pretty good. I wonder if they got like 50 caliber or if it's like a higher round. All right, we definitely want the snipers up here on the high ground and hopefully not going to get hit by the spitters. Oh, yeah. Luckily, the bugs are just dumb, you know? I mean, they're bugs. And then we're going to send these engineers in to roast them. Get in there. Oh, before those guys get here. Torch it. Yeah, so there's definitely like a way I think you should go. And if you don't go it, you're going to have a hard time. And we kind of learned that, I'd say, the hard way. Big squad's coming in. Can these guys... What's their range? Oh, their range is way out here. I wonder if I could move around here and throw a grenade into this bug tunnel and if that would kill them. Dude, snipers are some of my favorites. I'm gonna try the grenade strategy. Thorn hedges. Do I have to burn those? They have like hit bars and everything, so let's send engineers over. Yeah, engineers can burn them. Okay, good. Yeah, this is definitely like, let's sneak around here. This is some interesting level design, you know? It's sort of obvious, but at the same time, I'm, I'm glad that it's in. Wow, that's just... That's a thick bush. You know, <laughs> that sounds funny. Like, some of the bugs haven't been able to resist fire as much as that thorn bush has. We're gonna try this. Flanky and spanky. And they're able to pop everything that comes out of there. I'm gonna go in and throw the grenade. Oh, how do you... You can't... You shouldn't be able to see me. Oh, God. They're coming this way. We gotta get out of here. Oh, boy. This is problematic. Just throw the grenade. Throw it. Oh my god. It didn't work. Get back to base. How do I kill that bug tunnel? I'm gonna throw another grenade. This is weird. Maybe I can't kill that. Now, can I get my snipers and have them target? Choose elite ability. Unlock crippling shot. Fire special sensor device that relays the presence of nearby enemies, units in the fog of war. Huh. We'll go crippling shot. And I guess we could try the other one. Whoa. Yeah, we'll do that. Two crippling shots. That's really cool. Choose the lead ability. Boom bundle. Ooh, and we'll get shotgun. This is awesome. Okay, I didn't know about this at all. Got a boom bundle for them. Now, what's yours, engineers? You can't really do anything, but you can make machine guns, but there's no, like, metal area to do it here. All right, we're going to flank our marines around and hope these guys can just hold it. All right, so these guys have the shotgun under barrels. Can we see that in action? Doesn't look like it. Okay, go down there and frag that hole. We only have a few seconds. Oh my God, actually. Oh, seems like a big wave's coming. <laughs> okay, that was a bad move. Oh, this poor guy, run, Billy. You gonna die. All right, let's get another rifle squad. And your elite ability, well, you can't get there yet because you gotta get level three. These guys were both able to do it. Ah, this bug hole. This bug tunnel is controlled by that. Got it. We're going for it. We're going for it. Ooh, and there's a base here. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to defend this. This is gonna be dope. All right. This new brave squad who's not even elite yet just did all that. Okay. Everybody else get up here. Um, gonna have an elevated position here. This looks advantageous. Sir, satellite yeah, I knew it. Major bug movements. You don't have long. Use this valley as a kill zone. Okay. Use everything you got. If we don't hold them here, we'll all be dead anyway. Great. That sounds awesome. Ambush the attacking. Okay. Use choke points. Use all that stuff, right? Where's my engineer boys at? Snipers maybe up here? Wave approaching in 58 seconds. Got it. These are the shotgun boys. I can put in actually three machine guns. Oh. Holy crap. Oh no, I just lost the sniper squad. They got freaking ambushed. Where did these bugs come from? Okay, that was a mistake. We made many mistakes. Can I request a new one? Yeah, I can request a new sniper squad. Fantastic, we got two seconds. Here they are, they're coming. Snipers are already firing. No, 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 you're supposed to literally get here. And I'm setting a rifle squad up on this position as well. Oh, we got air for- yes! Oh, good. 
Can I build another machine gun? Looks like I can. We're gonna try to build one in the middle of the action. Can these guys not do anything? This might not be the spot then. That might be a sniper spot. And these guys weren't even firing. How about there? There we go. Now they're firing. This machine gun's about to go down, but don't worry, we just replaced it with another one right here. I mean, he fought bravely, okay? Actually, he might live. He might just live. All right, I mean, the, the red caution signal is still out there. And I'm moving a sniper squad to this spot since we lost one of our elites, which was a shame. Yeah, you guys take a peek and see what's up. Victory! Heck yeah! For the mobile infantry. We did pretty good. What do we got on the federal network? Colossians take great, take great pride, pride. In planet's mining industry. Ooh. Through sweat of brow, valiant colonists dig up the precious minerals the Federation needs. Uh huh. It's an ore effort for the war effort. This is my favorite and part. Not going These to let a few animations. Scare them off. The mobile infantry has begun escorting workers, many of them patriotic volunteers back into the mine. <laughs> Escorting so them? That kind of sounds like get back to work or we'll shoot better. you, doesn't it? Isn't that the irony of the of Starship Troopers is like, you know, the Federation is like this big bad meanie. Anyway, so we have completed whole patrol. It was brutal. Now this one's called Peace of Mind. This is the next mission. So if you guys do want to see more Starship Troopers, well, let me know. Pull the trigger on the like button and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.